Hello everybody, welcome to this Sweepy's BB Calm Trade video. I'm about to take a big bite of rice really fast. Mm -mm. Okay. Rice in mouth, let's get it. Um We're playing Timo versus Jace. Let's go cheese him. So we had a bit of a uh, not good things happening in the champ select. Apparently my mid laner only plays Kiana. And my jungler is like, hey. I only play Kiana. That guy's name is Timo King. Thirty seconds until minions spawn. Run, little piggy. One Timo King. One. Milf and cookies. Hmm. Well, we'll see what happens. Hmm. Yeah, honestly, we'll just do our best this game. Okay, Jace has Doran's blade, which makes his all in. Better than if it was longsword, but I think I still win. Put that there. Let's take E start. Damn, those are horny as fuck. What the hell? Dude, what is going on? Is it not Jace Top? Um. I don't care. I'm not leashing him. I don't want to leash this matchup. All good. Is he gonna walk all the way around? I feel like he won't. But maybe he will. And this guy is pinging the shit out of me. It's okay. I could have probably leashed him, but he's one of the guys in champ select who's being a bit mean. Which honestly made me want to leash him less. Reporting in. Let's just sit here. Dodge that, hit two off that caster. Ah, uh, Doku. Good little trade for me there. Level two advantage, level one. Plus he missed his Q, he just walked up and whipped it. Okay. Trying to go slow with this, we have push. So I want to just posture aggressively while I stack this wave and get as many CS as I can. If he uses Q to farm minions, I'm chill with it. And if he uses Q to miss on me, I'm also chill with it. Like, it's all good, you know? Okay. Malzahar support. It's a bit of a new one. They have the wonkiest team of all time. Okay, Caitlyn is super broken though. First strike, Caitlyn's actually OP. At first, I kind of thought it was a meme, but I've seen things, and it's like, damn. Okay, not the best trade by Mr. Jace. I think he'll TP back to lane. I mean, he has to TP back to lane. Is what I meant. So let's just get pushed in this lane too. Can he even buy a tier if he recalls? Okay, so he recalls, TP's back, but we have push though. He might just buy like a long sword. No, he does have a micro tier, but no potions. So he actually has no combat stats here. I'm down to just stay in lane then. Since he's no pots and uh, no combat stats. Ooh, almost caught that. Let's go ward this bush. Even though I don't think Talia can be up here. I guess Kiana's in her shit. Auto for auto Q, nice. It's fine too. I have push. I'll be able to crash this wave and recall whenever I want and he's no TP. Push in the lane. Go a bit slow with it. Oh. Eh. No. That would have given me a potion. Let's chill though. Let's just go boots too. I'll go berserkers because I'm crazy like that. Go berserker no pots because I'm crazy like that. Honestly, a better buy is probably to buy 
refillable boots, amp tome, pink probably. I have some leftover dollars. But I think boots too is fine here also. If I can get to this lane in time and pull it, that'd be really nice. Set up a little freeze. It forces him to stay or take a bad recall. Yeah, so let's go ahead and pull these minions. So he recalls, right? I pull these minions. I barely take any damage. Took like 100. But look, now this wave that showed up has to fight this wave of leftover minions plus the next one. So he's going to miss this wave entirely. He's going to lose every single minion in this wave, including the cannon. That's a lot of XP and dollars that he missed. Because he wasn't able to crash the wave in time and I was able to pull it. Some people might just let that wave crash, but no. We pull. He might even lose some of this next incoming wave too. So every every wave or every minion that cannon wave died, plus one melees, just one melees. So very good for us. And now that there's a lot of minions, we don't want to contest him to getting the the crash in because we'll lose a lot of HP. Collect the rest of the minions for free. Oh, I thought I was gonna live. And now we should be 7 to his 6 on the next wave. And then we look to tussle him. And Teemo King is a talkative guy. Uh, Jace went mid. I probably should have pinged it out. He definitely had the uh, roam timer there because he just got back to lane, but the wave was crashed. Let's see if we could sneaky him. Yeah, so he goes that way. Let's see what he does here. He might hard shove this and run up. Step on the shroom, maybe I get a free kill. If he goes from hammer form to range form, I'm so down to just fight him. Even in the minions. Okay, well he did it over there, which is... Okay, let's see what he does here again. Going slow. Shh. He has no idea. Is he gonna... Well, I fucked that up. I think I can still win this, though. Yeah, I do still win this. I'll flash out through him. Let Karthus have it. An enemy has been slain. In. I could have uh, taken that kill for myself, but sharing is caring. And I did just let Karthus die by not taking out that roam, so... Yeah, poorly played by me. I should have just went on him sooner, probably. But it's all good. It works. Go back to the base, get some potions now. And then let's go recurve Amptome. Get going for our Nashers. Talia was covering top, it's good. Whoa. Come on, you hit these. Oh, you actually uh, don't hit these. <laughs> and die. That's okay though. <laughs> Whew. Throwing our Kiana's got this. Kind of. I'm gonna move out to help him. Okay. I'm taking both of those. Sorry. Um, Jace doesn't have that much damage. I can kill him if he jumps on me. Get him, Zillion. Nice. I'll let Zillion have it too, because he helped me out. He uh, definitely didn't need to hold me there, but I appreciate him nonetheless. Do, do, do. Um, I believe his TP is still down from earlier. So let's go ahead and get this plate. Get the next wave too. It would be pretty chill if we could get our Nashers on the next base. Which would probably have meant I needed to take that Jace kill from Zillion. An ally has been but dude, just leaving him with the explosive device on him? Dude, that I like, can't resist. Okay, so it's... It's like really... I need to reset very, very badly, right? I'm missing like 400 health and I have $2,000 almost. But I'm also one wave away from our Nashers. I think it's too greedy to stay for the next wave, though. Because I stay for the next wave, right? I have to give Jace push, because I'm so low. 
Jace pushes this one, I collect it, then I recall, but Jace also then just pushes the next one, and I've recalled, and I've missed out. Which gets Jace back into the game, because he probably gets a wave up on me, and he gets tower place off of that, if I don't reset in that moment. So it like really fucks my tempo to get that item, even though I want to, right? Because now I'll have to go back to the base again, but it just is what it is. Let's see if I can run him down here. Eh, uh, let him go. Uh, I don't think the Ignite would have killed him. But maybe. Guys, not gonna lie, Teemo will carry. True, I'll do my best. Nice, got the dive and lived. I don't want to get Kaylin ulted, but she's dead. Pog. Let's just reset now, I'm really low. Or, let's get the wave first, actually. Because I have a shroom. One more wave. What's the worst that could happen? Watch doors. Checking for TPs. Nope. He TPs over there. Very good. Ludens Karthus? Is that normal? I feel like I normally see... Not Ludens. What's the other item? Leandries? Leandries. Shut down. Okay, so... Um, Malzahar support is OP apparently. Teemo King is the god of Teemo and is beating my Sivir, but don't worry, Sivir outscales. You know, Caitlyn has Karthus ulti for one person on a low cooldown, but Karthus has Karthus ulti on many people on a high cooldown. Tinking. Did you guys know that Karthus has Karthus ulti? Um, I could walk to mid. Yeah, let's do it. That guy's in a weird spot. I'm going. And he has not a shutdown. Okay, not actually going to be able to get him. Uh, I wanted to get that, but he has too many teammates around on that side. It would have been sus to go for it for me. Is Jace going to get the farm top, or is he over there? Hmm, he must be over there. Kiana has ulti. Go, 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 go. Kiana has ulti. Yeah, 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 yeah. Kiana has ulti? Nice. That guy has a hex drinker. Card this ulti soon. He'll probably die, I think. Nice. Let's go top, get this pushed in. Jace no TP, so we should be able to get a lot of tower plates here. Oh, and that guy died too? Very good. Sit here. Prime myself. Plates. Put that there in case somebody tries to show up to prevent me from getting as many as I can. Shroom the casters. I'm level 11, so my shroom will kill them. Don't want to take damage. Another plate. And another another plate? Oh. No, not another another plate. Just just four plates against this Jace. Okay. He lost a lot of his HP there. Hitting him with the side to side. Try not to get hit by the Q. Oh no! I think I can... Ah, uh, it's a bit sus. Let's hit the tower. Oh, he has a maw. <laughs> he has a full maw. I should have pressed tab. I was like, I think his hex drinker will still be on cooldown. Maw rush, Jace. You know? If it's, uh, if it's... If it's what works, it works. Dude, I don't think he has vision here, and he's staying. So let's see what he does here. Oh, no, he's going there. Okay, we can get the wave with this cannon. We can get, not the wave, the, uh, we can get the tower with this cannon wave. And Jay shouldn't be able to contest me. His maw is on cooldown after all. Stand behind the minions in case he's over there to EQ me. Good. 
We are a wave away from getting our Rhythmaker. We saw our potion, so I'll just stay. I think if Talia comes up here to try to kill me, I can outplay it with Flash. So, definitely not to just stay. Get that wave really fast. Recall, sell my potions, I'll have Rhythmaker, and that'll be really strong. Um, I think I'm going to start Persona 5 tonight. Have you guys played Persona 5 Royal? I think I'm going to give that a whirl tonight. It's okay, I got the first tower, it's all good, bro. I can take over on bots. Actually, let's just go run at this Talia and see if we can pick her up. Mm -mm -mm. Dragon spawning too. And... Oh, she's over there. Andy Caitlyn's recalling. Damn, that guy is fast as fuck. Flash and Ghost. And Ghost Blade, so... I'm not picking that guy up. Ooh, but I can get this guy. Yeah. This guy's mine. He's mine. Go over here, fight this guy. Very well played. Go over here, fight this guy. <laughs> Damn, I gave Jace top tower, but whatever. He can have it. Oh, he's going for the next one? Okay, even though he has Maw, there's no way he beats me in a fight now. Oh, his Q's on cooldown. Are we running into the tower today? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Did he think he was going to get to execute? Like, what was that guy thinking? Oh, shit. Alright, let's push this out. I don't know who this guy is talking to. He's like typing in all chat to his jungler, I think. Has Timo King lost his mind? Two autos on the melee to kill them. Yep. Let's rotate mid. Ooh, big Karthus autos. Running at her like a psycho. Auto Q should do the trick. That'll kill her. <laughs> that guy's. This is a bit of an NA Jace, huh? Bit of an NA Jace. I can tank it. We can do this. Uh, we can do the dragon. Wow. I don't know how that guy got there. But. Got there, he did. There's no way you're walking up, right? No, bro. I mean, I'll run it, Malzar. Fuck it. I think Karthus ulted for first strike winner to kill that guy. I'm pretty fed. <laughs> Dude, give me the EXP. What? Uh, I mean, Void Staff only for Jace's Maw. We could do that. It's a bit weird. Um, hmm. Dude, what if we went Shadow Flame? I'm kind of down to, to fuck around and see how it goes. I haven't built Shadow Flame in a hot minute since the durability update, really, but I like to buy it beforehand. You know, it gives a lot of AP, it gives a bit of pen, it gives uh, some HP, all stats that Teemo enjoys. I just kind of stopped buying it because, you know, when the durability update came in, flat pen got worse. And also, it's kind of good if you're stacking pen. So, like, if I'm going to go Shadow Flame, I think Sorks might be better than Berserkers. But Berserkers feel really nice just for the game in general. Like, if I buy Berserkers, you know, farming is better, jungling camps is better, doing objectives is better, getting PTA procs is faster. It just feels nice, like, in general. Don't want to get Malzar ulted. We did indeed get Malzar ulted. Oh, fuck. NT, NT. Oh, they have F'd. Nice. It's a dub. Well, there's the game. I hope you guys 
I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the uh, Ma first Jace gaming experience. Well, we gotta take a take a look at the damage dot really fast. I'll give it to Zillion. One Scion, two towers. Whoa. Promoted to gold one. Oh, we're reaching high elos. Dude, I did the most damage. Karthus out damaged me, and Kaylin out damaged Karthus. Dude, my champion's stinky. Fuck, I didn't even do the most damages. I'm mad now. Okay, I'm signing off. Angie, guys. Anger. Mm.